I just found this on my dresser. A uh, germ X moisturizing fresh citrus and synthetic kills germ in 15 seconds? Sponsored by germ. <laughs> nah, guys, I'm just joking. Uh, I have no idea why that's there. But today we're gonna be doing a three random games, but they're all scary, so is it really random? It's kind of just three scary games. Anyway, let's just get started with the first. Hope you enjoyed the video. I will put all these games in the description if you want to check them out, and let's get started. So this first game we're playing, guys, is called Maple County Interactive Training Tape. Now, this is apparently... Uh, I think it's like you're being trained to become a police officer and it's looking for like certain expressions and faces. I'm not really sure completely what it's about, but I just saw this game on itch. It looks really cool, nice, cool looking horror game. And I was just like, let's do it. What was that? Oh. Attention Maple County Police Department. Please take a seat. Your training video will begin momentarily. All right. This interactive training video, please remain seated. Pick up the remote on the table in front of you and give inputs when required. Thank you. I don't have my remote, guys. This interactive training video is brought to you by Maple County's Police Department. Nice, I in this can totally video, tell that you, you guys are police about officers. The current sweeping our state. We know very little about this threat, but as we learn and grow our knowledge, this threat will be removed in the following months. This the threat? Is not revealed this threat about? And everything you see in this training video is classified. Sharing this information with friends or loved ones is not permitted. Okay, not permitted. Exercise one, assessing the threat. Oh, the voice iron. On screen, two images will appear. On instinct alone, please choose the image that is the most unsettling. You will be scored at the end of this video. Okay, an exercise. All right. Uh, that one. Oh, good. Hmm, I don't like this game hard. Okay. Alright. Guys, I can't breathe. Every time I see my old house, I feel sick to my stomach. What the freak is that? I can't get my- I can't get his eyes out of my head. He was weightless. Almost floating. What are you talking about, that guy? Dash from room to room like a puppet on strings. Are they talking? Is that the threat? I think there's somebody in my kitchen. No. Oh no, if they bro, if they start playing video. Congratulations, you passed the first exercise. Okay. Next, we will learn more on how to identify voice. a threat. The first have identified these characteristics: lack of emotion and uncanny facial features. Yeah. Body language mirroring and verbal imitation. Lack of eye tracking and awkward movement. Oh, boy, that sounded like it was in my room. Oh, what's going on? Oh, is this is this like their bed? I gotta keep my hand up. Oh, you can move. Can't even see anything. I just saw something, bro. No. Hey, honey. Can you come in my room? I fell down. I need help. No, that's not her. I need you to see something. Come to my room. That's not her. Mom is dead. Bro. I just heard screaming like, Oh, honey, can you come in my room? No, no, no. <gasps> Play dead. Oh my god. But don't move. Huh. What the freak was that? Yellow, Sheriff's Department. Uh, hi, so this could be nothing, but there's this really freaky dude that's been chasing my house, I think. <clears throat> well, uh, can you d describe him to me at least? Um, I mean, I mean it's, it's like pitch black outside. But, um, I, I think he might be on, like, drugs or something. He's moving, like, really weird. Well, uh, is he doing anything illegal, or...? Oh, uh, no, f*** you guys. F nothing happens out here. Just send someone. Gee, I'm just freaked out, man. It's just, this never happened. All right, all right, what's he doing right now? Um, huh, Jesus. 
Like, he just, he just kind of, I mean, he definitely knows I'm looking at him. And he knows I'm calling the cops, so hopefully he'll f*** off, but I, I don't know, something's just, what's your address? It's, uh, no road. Yeah, Wait, did they say a like, real address? Uh, my mom's passed out in the other room, I'm not trying to, like, wake her up and freak her out of the f*** day she had. <laughs> yep, we'll see you soon. Inspired by Mandela Catalog. I've heard of that dude on YouTube. You know that series? That was awesome. Oh my god, dude. I love that. That was so immersive. You know what I think? You know, when we were looking through like the corridor, right? And that guy was running towards us. I, I freaked out completely. I think that monster went on, on the phone call when the guy was calling the police. I think that is the threat. That is the monster in imitating his voice just to find more people to kill. Completely. That's what I think. There's no way he would be that calm. Like, uh, yo, this dude's staring at me. You know, I, I'm calling the cops on him. My mom's passed out in the other room. Like, to be honest, I, I don't even know what to do. Uh, he's like right in front of me, you know, scariest thing I've ever seen, but you know, it's okay. So I'll tell you my address. So my address is like, why is he so chill? Anyway, this game was so cool, but let's move on to the nether. To the nether? To the nether? What are we playing Minecraft in the next game? What the frick are you talking about? <laughs> down, down. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait. Saying nothing. How the frick did they do that? That's actually so cool. Um, I gotta turn my volume up. So this next game we're playing, guys, is called There Are No Players Online. Or No Players Online? I think it's called that. Ooh, this is like a first-person shooter horror game. I don't know how that works, but uh, yeah. Or there's one that's offline. There's a lot that's online. Uh, can we just join this one? Joining server. Please wait. Whoa. Okay, now this is cool. It's looking for players? What? Wow. Oh, okay, now that's cool. Uh, this is interesting. Yeah, this is actually really cool. Wow, this is really cool. So, are we gonna get the flag? Yeah, I guess let's just go get the flag. Um, there's nothing to be said here. Let's just get the flag, you know what I'm saying? I don't know where the flag is, but, um, you know what? I'm getting a really bad vibe. You know what first-person shooter games have always taught me? Check the corners and watch your six. And if they use that to their advantage to make a horror game, I'm done. Okay. Okay. Alright. We're fine. Be a man. Be a man and get over there. Over here? No, how about- hey, 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 whoa, 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 how about we not go over there? Yeah, yeah. Oh my freaking gosh. I'm literally sweating. Like, I'm- I'm literally sweating. Ah. Oh, what the freak is that? Don't look, don't look, don't look behind me. I swear there's somebody behind me. Sorry if I'm out of focus, guys. Hold on. Alright, we're good? Let's just- Yes! Get to the flag. Perfect. Yep, we're alright. Breathe in. Breathe. Be a man and just... Oh. Was that supposed to happen? We have to get another flag. Oh. Okay, now this is... Oh. My. Ah! <laughs> Take it chill. Alright. Don't accidentally shoot your gun. Bro, if I hear anything, bro. I'm literally... Scream... I'm lit. Why is there a red light? What was that? Don't care. Don't care whatsoever, bro. Get the freaking flag. This one has joined the game. We can go this way, or we can go back. I have the flag. No. Wait, we can't go that way. We have to go the opposite way. Oh, bro. I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate. I, I can barely, like, look at my screen. Oh, don't. Dude, look, in this game, don't watch your six. Don't watch your six whatsoever. Stay, stay going 12 o'clock, boy. All right, get ready for it. Wait, what? Huh? What? What's going on? Oh, what the freak? Yo. Uh. Oh, my God. What's good? How you doing, homie? 
Oh, boy, my sucker said, what's good? You have to get the last flag, make me feel like we don't have time. <gasps> Alright, I'm being prepared for her to just be her? Why Why do I keep using those pronouns? I am just ready for the, that thing to just appear. I'm ready for it. Bro, a game has not done this to me in a while since Five Nights at Candy's. Specifically the third one. That thing isn't following me, is it? I don't care. I don't care. You know what? I don't care. I don't care. We're just gonna get that flag, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna get that. We have the yes. flag. Why is everything shaking? Can't freaking no. shoot. Oh, we can reload. Oh my gosh, yep, she's appearing right here, right then. Yep, right there, right there, yep, right there, yep, yep, yep. Yay! You better stop! Again? Reload. Reload. Shoot. Okay, so someone has joined the game. As a spectator, start what you're doing. Do not move another step. Whatever you do, do not deliver that flag. How did you even get access to this game? Can you hear me? Uh, no. If you can read this, press Y to chat and say something. Why? I'm pressing Y. It's not actually working, guys. Wait, never mind. I don't think you have chat permission on this server. Just shoot twice if you can read this. Nope. Oh, freak. Bro, reload. Yeah, I can read it, bro. Okay, so you can read this. Nice. Yes, I can. So let me explain. If you deliver that last flag, the servers will shut down. I absolutely cannot let that happen. I've been working on this project for more than 11 years. I can't let you jeopardize all my work. This may look like a simple FPS game to you, but this game has the power to raise the dead. So what's the entity throughout this? Is that someone who's dead? It's still a work in progress, as you can probably tell. I'm making this so I can see my wife again. So is that, was that black thing her wife? Wait, what? But she seems to be so- Okay, can do that? You probably already met her. She might come over a bit aggressive, but she's just scared and confused. I've been able to keep her relatively calm by playing her favorite music. <gasps> That's a very- So- That is his wife! If you deliver that last flag, her soul will be set free. But I know I can save her and bring her back. Please, press escape and shut down the game. Please. You know what? Let's let her soul be set free. Alright? This dude's been working on this game for 11 years? Why? Why, bro? Just, just let go. I, you should not be working on no game. For le Whoa. Getting real bright. Go back. Stop it. You know what, bro? I don't care. Let's let her soul be set free. Kicked from server. Reason connection to host lost so we s we shut down all the servers huh pressing up arrows enter enter nothing's working clicking there's nothing game's over let me reopen the game one time hold on why are we still here i've reopened the game see what happens all right so the same thing happens it's Boss? What? Okay, bro. That is actually really strange. Now, I have heard there is some secrets to this game, and there is, like, a, a secret code that you can enter. Is there any way for me to, like, go back? Just, just wondering. Don't think there is. I have heard there are hey. some secrets to this game. Oh, sh I have heard there are some secrets to this game, so if you guys want to see this game specifically in an entirely different episode, just exploring the different secrets of this game and maybe finding some stuff, or maybe just it being a mini part of another episode, leave a like or comment down below because I'm really interested already. This game is really cool. I like the concept of it. It's really nice, and knowing that it has secrets, being aware of something like that just makes me want to play this game more. We will come back to this, I promise. Anyway, that was today's Three Random Games video. That was just a crazy ride. The first game, it it really scared me to the core. Same with this one. Like that that one, like I I really like couldn't look at the screen. Like I couldn't look. It was the weirdest thing ever. It felt so real. It felt like I was actually in danger. Like yeah, I'm I'm still like freaking out over how that game was just terrified me. And the thing about this one is that it also feels real. It feels like a creepypasta. Something like that. There's this weird entity that keeps appearing in this certain game. Like, stuff like that really freaks me out. So, playing a game 
that's kind of based on all that kind of stuff really terrified me. So yeah, these were three fantastic games. I'm so glad I played these, man. It is 8.56 right now, so I'm literally crapping my pants. Yeah, these games were just so cool, man. And I just can't wait to edit this and get it out to you guys. And uh, yeah, I guess that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like. Can you flick on? <sighs> Back at it again, bro. Can't, can't freaking speak. Stuttering. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave. Wow, bro. So many. I can't even end the video. I freaking, I freaking stutter, and then my camera wants to go out of focus. You son of a. How would I just do this? Yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like. And if you like the content that I create and don't like my camera going out of focus, consider subscribing. And as always, see you in the next one. Peace. Yeah.